Okay, now many of us are aware of a module called Nice Shot on GoodLock application, which adds some additional features or options for screenshots or screen recording feature. Now for this particular module, we got an update a couple of weeks ago about which I could not make a video. So I thought I will just share what has really happened, what has really changed on this module. If you are someone regularly takes screen recordings or screen capture, then you should know what has really changed here. So let's dive in and take a look at the change log. As you can see, it says delete the do not copy image to the clipboard when saving, delete the selfie video options, selfie video size settings. Both of them are applicable for One UI 5.0. Now here there is no good news as such. We don't see any new features being added, but we have lost a couple of features here. However, these features may not be relevant. Now let me open this module and show you what has really changed. As you can see, now we just get four options here. Whereas if you look at the previous version, I have taken a screenshot of the previous version. As you can see here, we have a toggle here on the top which says do not copy image to the clipboard when saving. It is applied to all functions of screenshot, scroll capture, capture, smart select and screen write. After you enable this toggle, whenever you capture a screenshot, it does not get copied to the clipboard. That was a feature which we had, but that was not really needed. Not many of us were using this feature. We want the image to be copied to clipboard so that we can paste it anywhere we want. So that feature was not really relevant. So with this update, they have deleted that particular toggle. We don't have do not copy image to clipboard when saving toggle on this all new nice shot module. Now let me talk about the second change that we have. This could be important for some of you guys. As you can see, we have got selfie video options. When I tap on this, these are the options we get make the background color transparent auto detect background color select color to make transparent color detection sensitivity these options were there on the previous version also after this we have got a toggle here called double selfie video size this is the only toggle we get by the way this feature adds the selfie video recording while recording the screen now when we enable this toggle the size of the selfie video will increase to double whereas on the previous version as you can see we have selfie video size which can be custom customized by sliding this bar. We can reduce it two steps smaller or two steps larger by using this particular bar here. And then we had an option double selfie video size. Now I'm not sure how many of you would prefer these five different size options for selfie video size while recording the screen. Let me know in the comment section whether this is really relevant or not. So Samsung has simplified this feature as well. We just get one toggle now to double the selfie video size while recording the screen. These are the changes which we have got. No feature additions, just the feature deletions which is common on Samsung Galaxy phones. That's all I wanted to share with you guys. Let me know whether you have updated this application. How many of you guys really use this particular module on your phone? Drop a comment and be sure to subscribe. We are reaching closer to 50K subscribers. Your support is really needed. So go ahead, smash the subscribe button and hit that like button if you find this video useful. Thanks for watching. My name is Salian signing off. Cheers. Bye-bye.